Hi everyone, it's Tanya. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, it's a fall haul, y'all. It is like Christmas in August for me right now. This is just so fun. My husband got all my bins out of the attic and I had purchased a lot of things last year, actually everything that I'm going to show you. I bought it last year after the fall season was over in Hobby Lobby and my local grocery store had marked down all of their items. Everything in this video was either 75 to 90% off. Amazing prices for fall decor. That is actually my number one tip for you guys is that anytime you know you wanna decorate for a particular season, go after the season is over and hit up all the clearance areas and get all the things that you need to decorate for that season the following year. It has been wonderful and worked out great for me. I have paid just pennies to the dollar sometimes or just even a few dollars for something that maybe at full price would have been $15 or $20. It's insane how much money you can save just by shopping after the season is over. We've got a lot of items to cover. I'm actually gonna probably start with the larger items first just so I can clear them off the bed and get them out of this space so I can actually have a little more room to move because right now I'm kind of squished up in this little corner of my bed right now just because I have everything spread around me. And just a little FYI, um, I literally only put one representation of the items even though I only have one spread out on the bed it doesn't mean that I didn't buy two or three or four or five or more. <laughs> it's just what I put on here because I didn't want to have all these things around me. So I decided just to bring one to display and show you guys. And then of course you'll have to come back to see how many more items of each I had and where I use them in my home to decorate for fall. Let's get started. The first thing I want to show you guys is this galvanized metal bucket that says hand-picked farm fresh pumpkins 50 cents a pound this is super cute it's super large so i'm really excited to have this to decorate this year and that was originally 39.99 and so you do the math i'm just i might let you all know what the original prices were because honestly it's been a year and i cannot remember how much each item was and which items were 75 percent off and which items were 90 percent off but everything was way less than what it's priced at so anyway this is the first item super cute right there obviously the obvious thing to do with this would be put some pumpkins in it right but you never know or a co cozy blanket and a pillow um who knows i don't know what i'm going to do with it yet i'm going to have to figure this all out as i go that's why i'm super excited about everything another large item is this yard pumpkin and so it's got the little brown stem you can see a little bit of a I'm not sure what kind of a print is that oh it's like a leaf print in there can you see that and I don't even see a tag on this so I have no clue what it was originally but anyway it's a yard display and most likely I will use it in my yard although um, I might even use it inside you just never know the next item are these flameless LED candles and there's a set of five yes one two three four five you can see in a beautiful fall color originally 44.99 these will be great to create a nice cozy ambiance in our home the next item if you watched my summer home tour you would have seen that i actually use this for my summer decor but it's actually a robert stanley fall item and it's a galvanized metal trowel and I used it, um, I obviously bought it last year, but I used it for my summer decorating. That's another little tip I have for you guys. I try to do that often. Anytime I can use decor from one season and carry it over into another season, I try to do that because that is another way to save money, not only buying it 
on deep clearance, but also reusing the item for different seasons, that's another way that you can reuse your items multiple times and save money and not have to go out and buy new things. This particular one was originally $24.99 and it's got the little handles, galvanized metal. It's pretty long and I am honestly thinking about probably putting in some faux pumpkins or maybe some floral stems. I'm just not sure yet. Again, it's all going to be decided once I start decorating. So come back <laughs> to see it all come together. Let's look at this sign behind me. It was originally $19.99. It looks like a picket fence and it says, Hello Fall, Pumpkin Spice, Apple Picking, whoops, Autumn Harvest, Boots and Sweaters, Hay Rides, Pumpkin Patch. Guys, that is hard to read backwards, <laughs> but I did my best. Anyway, this is such a cute sign. I could think of multiple places to put this. I could put it outside by my front door. I could put it inside, um, maybe on a tabletop because it's it's tall, but it's not as tall as another sign I've used at my front door. Um, I could also flank it by the fireplace. There's just so many places that I could think of that, I, that have potential to put this sign. So we'll have to see where it winds up going. Now this next item is actually a wood serving board and it was more like a clearance item and it says it was 624. You can see that it's, it's in that light weathered wood and it says forever grateful. Super cute and I'm excited to put this out and it has a little spreader on it and let's see here. I believe it is food safe. It says to wipe with a damp cloth. Actually, I'm not really sure. I'll probably just use it for decor, so it really doesn't matter. <laughs> Next thing I got was some raffia. Feel like you can never have enough of that. I picked some up last year and then I got some more on clearance just because I think it's a fun little item to use to accent your decor to make it feel more rustic and fall-like. So picked up a bag of that. Also got this little corn husk wreath. It almost looks like it has little like pieces of wheat in it, but it's not, but it kind of resembles wheat to me. It was originally $19.99. And um, I do remember there was four of these. So got those as well. Now I have this little apple cider mason jar sign it was actually a gift from my mom and dad they actually gave me some fall decor for christmas last year and so some of that that they purchased for me is mixed in and i remember most of what they gave me but i'm not 100 percent sure um, which items they got and which items i got so but this one for sure i know was from my mom and so it's and dad and it says apple cider it's a cute little sign can you hear it? <laughs> it's bells, acorn bells. <laughs> I thought these were so cute. I actually think my husband showed these to me last year. He was he was with me when I was shopping at Hobby Lobby when everything went 75% off and 90% off. And so he's the one who pointed these out. Super cute, just with some jute and brown ribbon, little acorns, very neutral. And I'm pretty sure I will hang these on my blanket ladder I think we'll see oh and those were originally $8.99 I also got this tiny little tobacco basket pretty sure it's from the fall section because I already use this again in my summer decorating I love to do that take pieces from one season and use them in another season and so I cut the tags off but I'm fairly sure that this was fall decor that I picked up last year so it's just like a little mini Tabasco Tabasco <laughs> <laughs> tobacco basket that was a tongue twister <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> okay next thing I got was this cute little pumpkin pick and this as far as I know I only picked up one I guess they probably only had one and I snagged it and I'm sure it was probably cents it was originally $4.99 and I think it's super cute. Obviously, you can put it in as a pick inside of something, but I even was thinking that I might even be able to cut this little stem off and then put it in as bowl filler 
as kind of like, since it's only one, maybe as like the focal point of an arrangement. I don't know, but I just thought that that might be something I could do with it as well so that I don't have to necessarily pick it inside of something. But I could, but I don't have to. And that's the other thing about decor. When you get pieces, think of how you, I know that we they're written how they're intended, right? But it doesn't necessarily mean that we have to use them that way. We can take this pick and instead of picking it inside of a floral arrangement, we can cut this off and then put it into a basket or a bowl or whatever, whatever we want to do with it. So that's the fun thing about decorating is you can make it your own, create your own style with it, and just do something unique and different with it. So love this little pumpkin. Now, the next thing I've got is this acorn stem, which was originally $3.99. I'm gonna bring it in closer so you guys can see. It's got some beautiful yellow and touches of orange in the leaves. Um, brown acorns and this cute little mini pine cone and it even has some of these little pit berries on there so it's just super cute and again i just thought it was great for fall and at clearance prices who can beat them not me okay and i'm sure you guys are thinking all right where are the pumpkins yes i got some pumpkins too i felt like last year when i was decorating that i didn't have enough pumpkins so i added some more to my collection so one of the ones I got was this green little pumpkin, originally $4.99, little stem. It's like the little standard traditional type pumpkins that they sell at Hobby Lobby. Then I got this one also. This one was more in like a pinky peachy color. And so same thing, $4.99, they're the same size, but they're cute for using as fillers in displays or just to expand my pumpkin collection. The classic truck. This one I know my mom got me too. Um, she got me this little white truck and I actually was excited about it being white because again, white being neutral, I can put something in the back of it and it can go with me from season to season to season. I used it, I wanna say last winter, um, right out, she had gifted it to me for Christmas. I used it in, the, in my winter decor for shelf styling. Then I used it this summer for 4th of July shelf styling. So little pieces like this, classic little pieces that you can just reuse are great to have in your little collection. Here's another little piece that I thought was so cute for our coffee bar, morning pumpkin. And then this other one says, you had me at pumpkin spice. <laughs> Isn't that cute? As soon as I saw these, I was like, oh, those are adorable. And they were originally $9.99. No question, these are going on my coffee bar this year. I'm excited. Here's an item I didn't even remember buying last year, but when I saw it, I'm so glad that I did. It's got this pl uh, plaid, oh, sorry, this plaid print all over it. Again, a neutral piece that I can use um, for shelf styling. And I can use it year after year just because it's so simple. It's just a little plate. It's on the larger side. I'm not sure what size it is, but it looks like a dinner plate. Neutral colors, neutral design, and I'm excited to work it in. I will probably use this in my hutch, most likely. And that was originally $14.99. that cute? Let's see here. Ah! <laughs> We've lost some decor, but don't worry, it's okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is funny. <laughs> I told you this was like, I'm like in this little squeezed in corner over here just trying to manage it all and not break anything and not miss anything. So anyway, I might have to start, cause this is breakable, I think I'm gonna put it over here. I don't want it to fall. The next item I wanna show you are these cute little light up houses. Aren't they cute? Um, my parents got me the large one and the small one. And I'm so glad they did because our Hobby Lobby, by, by the time the 75% rolled around, they were already gone at my local Hobby Lobby. And my parents live four hours away from me and my mom was able to find these and she gifted them to me. So I'm really excited to use them this year. Let me see. Oh, they've got the little tags in them. I can't, 
I can't light them up, but you guys know they light up inside. They're really cute. And I love that they have that copper on the top. To me, copper is just one of those metals that really feels like fall to me, just because it's got that brown, orangey tone to it. And so I just love copper in the fall. I just think it's so beautiful. So I'm super excited to use these. I will probably either use these as tabletop decor or as shelf styling. The next item, oh, I don't think I told you how much those were. Um, the smaller one was $8.99 and the larger one was $9.99. Okay, so moving on to this galvanized metal pumpkin. This was originally $15.99. I got this one to replace one that I had purchased a couple years ago. Two years ago, I got this beautiful one that I think was made out of resin from the Robert Stanley collection. And unfortunately, I had it on the edge of our media console and someone was like walking by with their blanket and it knocked off, fell, broke into a ton of pieces. My sweet husband tried to repair it back for me and it just was kind of far beyond repair. So I decided to replace it with this galvanized metal one so we don't have to worry about breakage um, next time. So anyway, this is cute. It's got a little twisted stem and some metal leaves and of course the galvanized hammered look all over it. Very textured. I don't know, I just think it's cute and it's not breakable. That's a plus. <laughs> okay, here's another fun one. So I'm gonna tell you what my idea is. You know how I say about using decor in different ways? Um, or maybe I shouldn't tell you guys, then you'll have to come back and see. Hmm, hmm, I think that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> you'll have to come back and see what I do with these. So basically these are pumpkin place card holders. So yes, they are pumpkin place card holders, but I will not be using them as pumpkin place card holders. So come back to see what I do with these little babies. <laughs> but anyway, they're cute, they're metal, and they're just white, neutral pumpkin place card holders. The next thing I have is this cute little Hello Fall sign. It was originally $6.99, so adorable. I actually um, purchased the cuddle weather one in green i think two years ago yes definitely two falls ago and i thought that was so cute and um i decided to pick up this hello fall one because it matches it's in the same family but different colors green the other one's green this one's orange but they have the same cute little leaf design around it and the other one says cuddle weather and this one says hello fall so i just thought it'd be a cute addition because they kind of go with each other keep them together. <laughs> this next item is one of my husband's picks. <laughs> we were shopping and he says, let's get this. And I was like, okay, <laughs> isn't it cute? It's a little hedgehog and it ha holds like the little sponge inside. And he was like, let's get that for the sink. And I said, all right, again, it was, let me see. Originally $6.99, we probably paid a dollar for it, if even. And so it'll look cute at our sink. I have a feeling um, my kids are gonna like seeing that by the sink. Isn't it cute? Let me zoom in closer so you can see it. All the little texture, there's the back of it. So sweet little hedgehog, definitely will be placed by the sink. The next item is this beautiful Robert Stanley table runner that was originally $29.99 and if you watched my spring decorate with me you would have seen it but it is reversible so I actually displayed this side on my dining table in the spring and I'm planning this fall to use this pumpkin side on my dining table or maybe my entryway I'm not quite sure which area it's gonna go um, but I'm kind of gonna have to play with it and see which area I like it best because our dining room furniture is very dark and so I like the idea of using this to lighten up the area but I'm also not sure how it's gonna look once I place it on the table so another reason to 
stay tuned and come back to see because I'm not even sure what I'm doing. <laughs> but anyway, this is this beautiful neutral table runner. So pretty and again, reversible and usable for multiple seasons. More pumpkins. I got these and ladies, we all know what time it is, right? Let me tell you if you don't know. You guys, it's filler, filler time. Yeah, it's filler time. <laughs> yeah, I just did that. <laughs> you guys, this is the time for fillers. We can totally use all of these little pumpkins as fillers in bowls. And I have more fillers to show you. These were originally $12.99. Bring on all the fillers. Pumpkin fillers, acorn fillers, corn fillers. All the fillers, bring them on. <laughs> I love these little fillers. And I got the orange pumpkins and the white neutral cream pumpkins, and they were originally $7.99 each. Then I got this corn filler, and it was $1.99. I thought those were cute for fall and Thanksgiving. Then I got the brown acorns and the white neutral acorns and they were originally $6.99 each. This is another little cute one. Homemade pumpkin pies baked fresh daily. I thought this was so cute, so cute. And I'm definitely hanging this on my little um, kitchen towel ladder in the kitchen for sure, for sure, this is going on there. If I don't put it there, I'd be super surprised because that's the plan right now. And this was originally $5.99 and I just think it's so sweet. It's very simple, but it's just so adorable. Or should I say, it's gorgeous. Here's another little item I like. These are fall ornaments. And they're little leather tags, which I think are so cute. Oops, let me show it to you this way. This one says grateful. Then this one says blessed. And then this other one says thankful. So they are meant to be ornaments, but I may use them as ornaments and I might not. Again, this is one of those items where I may use them as what they're intended for, but I also may not. I've got a little idea up here for them. So we'll see, we'll see once I start decorating. This one says, I love fall most of all. And I kind of do. It's originally $5.99, just a cute little tabletop decor sign or shelf style. Si just a little, okay, let's try that again. Just a little tabletop dis, <laughs> J take three <laughs> just a little tabletop sign or shelf styling sign cute little decor okay oh yes let me show you i don't know there's still so many things that i'm just like which direction do i go where what do i show them next i don't know okay let me see what about maybe this so I got these little mini hay bales in the craft section. As you can see, they were $1.99, but of course, really, really inexpensive because I got them at either 75 or 90. I was thinking of using these on my tiered tray. If I wind up doing a tiered tray this year, I'm pretty sure I will. I always do a tiered tray. So I don't see why I wouldn't but that's probably most likely where these are gonna go because when I bought them last year, that's what I intended to use them for. Let me show you guys another fall pick that I got. This one was originally $5.99. So it has a neutral sunflower, some berries, some more berries, and something that kind of looks like wheat, but not really, leaves. I'm not really on the up and up with what the stems are exactly, but to me, it's a sunflower and some berries and some leaves, and it looks very fall. So I'm excited to use that somewhere in my home. So the next item, when I pulled it out of the bin and unwrapped it, I said, oh my gosh, 
I didn't even know I had a fall mug. <laughs> Seriously, it is like Christmas in August. I was unwrapping everything yesterday to get ready to set, um, set it all out to show you all. And I was like, some of the things that I purchased, I remembered. Some of the things I didn't. Some of the things my mom gave me, I remembered. Some of the things I didn't. So as I was un, um, opening all these bins yesterday and unwrapping everything, it seriously was like Christmas in August. So when I opened this, I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't even remember that I had gotten a fall mug. So of course, it's a little pumpkin with a little pretty leaf and the little green stem is the handle and it was originally $11.99. So that's pretty exciting. I was excited about it when I opened it. Can't wait to make some hot chocolate in it. Okay, the next item I got were these cute little measuring spoons in the copper color for $6.99. And these will probably either go at uh, my baking station or on my tiered tray. That's usually what I kind of do with these little, these little things. I got this cute little wreath with the subtle colors of fall. It's got more of the green, but it's got touches of orange and touches of yellow, but it's not overpowering. And it's a little mini wreath. So again, this is another one of those items where I've got multiple ideas going on and I think I have at least five of these, maybe seven. And so I have plenty to utilize for multiple ideas. We'll just have to see what I wind up doing with them. The next item I picked up were these stacked pumpkins. They're there are three, one, two, three. They're kind of like, you can see how they're stacked. And they're just neutral, which I loved. This one has more like a wood tone. This one has, hmm, I guess like a leaf scrolly design. And then this one has that little beading. I love the beading around this. Interesting little story. When my husband and I got married, there was this um, plate set dishes set at Macy's and it had this little beading around the edge and I loved that style then and then in recent years this little beading has come back to being popular in items and I just am so drawn to the little beads I just love them on the edges of things I think they're so pretty so I guess you could say that I love this beading because I loved it um, let me think almost 17 years ago and I still love it now. So I guess that's something that I am just drawn to. I love the beads. This was originally, if I didn't say already, $14.99. Super cute and neutral for fall. I've got this little pumpkin pick with the fall leaves and what looks like wheat and, right, this one really does look like wheat right there. And then this kind of looks like little corn husk and then it's got these leaves right here. And then of course, whoops, I gotta flip that. The fall leaves, these need to be played with a little bit. Anyway, you get the gist. And these were originally $4.99. So that's those. Another thing I thought was cute that I picked up was this cute little plate. It was $5.99. And it's like a little treat plate, snack plate, pumpkin just white and you can see it's kind of curved in a little bit. It's got this little detailing in here to resemble the ridges that a pumpkin would have. And it's got the little black outline around the edge. And I just thought they were so cute. These I bought four because we're a family of four, so I picked up four. Next item is this kitchen towel. This one was $7.99 and it says, Hello Fall. This is one that my mom gave me, I'm pretty sure. And this one, because it's in a darker color, I will probably actually use this one. The other one I showed you earlier, that was the white tea towel. I won't use that one. That would be just for display because I know it would get dirty and then I'd never be able to get it white again. This particular one, because it's in this beautiful olive green color, I will probably actually utilize it for um, drying our hands by the sink. So this one's a cute little towel. 
leaves on it and it says hello fall and definitely with the color it's definitely made for functionality in my opinion this next item is a little stand it's not very big so it'd probably be perfect to kind of place a little pumpkin on it if you wanted to create some varying heights for a display it's in this beautiful green it's got this little um I don't know what you'd call that like a it's not really a scalloped edge but it kind of is fluted edge maybe scalloped fluted edge you can see that little detailing right there and it's just cute I think it'd be perfect to just place a little pumpkin or something fall like on it and it was originally $9.99 the next thing I want to show you guys is this hello autumn sign it's got the three different pumpkins, an orange, a green, and to me this looks like a like a blue, a shade of blue. And it was originally $7.99. And turns out I picked up one for myself and then my mom got me one, so now I have a set of two. So I'm probably gonna either do some sort of styling where I mirror them next to each other or across from each other, or I might place one in one area of the house and then the other one in another area of the house. But either way, I thought it was cute and now I have two. The next thing I'm gonna show you is this little pick and it was originally $3.99 and I thought it was really cute. Reason being that I had bought a sign a couple of years ago, yes, a couple of years ago and it has this either this exact pattern or something very similar to it. So when I saw this pumpkin, I thought, okay, this is perfect because they either match exactly or they go with each other. So again, with the pumpkin pick, I can pick it in something. This one I probably will actually use as a pick just because this um, stick is very sturdy. I mean, I'm sure I could you know, ask my husband to cut it off if I wanted him to or if I wanted it to be, but I really don't want to. I think I'm going to use this as a pick somewhere in my home. Here is this other little greenery that I got kind of looks like grass, blades of grass, and then wheat in the middle. You can see that right there. And I wanna say I only got one of these. They must have only had one because that's all I got. Three, and it was originally $3.99. So this will be one of those things where I use it in a very, very small vase because this would be just enough to fill something like that. Or it might be something where I just wanna add a different texture in the midst of something. Um, but anyway, either way, I got this little stem and I'll be using it somewhere. Next item are these wood craft leaves. I think these are so cool. They're so rustic and different looking and I just feel like they're great to either put in like a bowl as filler or even as an accent to other decor. I don't know, I just thought they were really neat and they do appear to be real solid wood and and if it's not, well, it's pretty good. It's done so well that I can't tell if it is or isn't. I think they're beautiful pieces, very unique, different. I think they'll be great for decorating in certain areas of our home. So I'm excited about those. Oh, and they were originally $5.99. The next item I got was this Pitberry Garland and it was originally $3.99 and it's a little garland and I just thought it might be great to accent something. This is another one of those items, again, I'm not really sure where I'm going to utilize it yet, but it's definitely neutral and it's a garland so I could definitely place it and use it as a garland, maybe mixed in with some leaves of garland or I might even be able to put them inside of a lantern to accent an, a lantern. I'm just not sure yet, but I got a couple of these. The next thing I got were these ticking striped pumpkins, which were $8.99 each. They are actually weighted down, um, so they are soft, they are 
plush, but they have a weight inside to help them stay put, which is really nice because they are lightweight. If, imagine if they didn't have the weight inside, they would be really lightweight and they might just fall over as you try to place them or not hold the position you want them in. So what's really nice about them is they are weighted and I'll, I got the orange ticking stripe as well as the green ticking stripe. I also got this neutral pumpkin lamb's ear mini wreath for $14.99 and you can kind of see that and there's the little white pumpkins they're kind of tucked in there I've got to fluff that and play with that to make them show a little bit better the next item that I really thought was cool were these long tall cinnamon sticks Sometimes I use cinnamon sticks when I'm decorating, but I use the ones that you get at the grocery store and they are half the size of these. So when I saw these, I thought these were really neat because they're extra tall and then I won't have to put paper or a plastic bag or something at the bottom of where I'm trying to have them show out of because they would be tall enough and they smell good. So cinnamon sticks are great for decorating these were originally $6.99 the next item I picked up was this grass looking stem and no clue where I'm going to use it but I will find a place for it I'm sure and it was originally $4.99 and it's just a grass looking stem in like a like a yellow green color the next item i picked up was this little white craft pumpkin it's got that textured kind of a feel maybe you can see that and it's just neutral and sweet um i am probably going to use it as is this year but what i liked about it is i have the option to paint it if i ever get tired of it just being this way originally it was 4.99 the next item is this sign that was originally $21.99 and it says pumpkin pie, hot cocoa, candy corn, crisp apples, apple cider, pumpkin spice, fall treats. I just think this is so cute and so I'm most likely gonna put this at my coffee bar. I'm excited to use this one. Fun little story, yesterday when I was unboxing everything out of the bins my daughter says mom you're getting me in such a um the fall mood she says i'm gonna go make some hot chocolate right now and she really did <laughs> she made some uh, for her and her brother so i thought that was super cute and super funny just me pulling out all the fall stuff put her in the fall mood for hot chocolate so that is it for the Hobby Lobby stuff, but I did want to include a few other pieces I picked up at a couple of other places. So this, so this one item actually is another item that was from my mom and it's a little wheelbarrow that says hello fall with the little sunflowers on the wheels. And she said she got this for me from at home. She said she thought it was so cute. She, she picked it up there. It was originally $7.99 from the at home store. I'm not sure if they have it this year or not because she bought it for me last year. So this is super cute. This would be cute for tabletop decor or shelf styling. Our local grocery stores are actually called HEB, so you may or may not have one in your area. But last year after fall, they had these beautiful brown pumpkins. This is more, it was, con I guess it's considered the large size. They had two sizes. To me, it's kind of like a medium sized pumpkin. You can see it in comparison to my hand, but it was originally $15 a pumpkin and I got it for a dollar fifty. A dollar fifty, you guys, from $15 to a dollar fifty. So that was amazing. Then they had one in this size. You can see the color is just slightly different. This particular one was only 50 cents once it was on clearance and it was said and done. So super excited about these little pumpkins for this year. And the final thing I picked up is they were having a garage sale around our area. And so we decided to stop off and check 
check this one in particular out um, on a Saturday. We were just like, oh, there's a garage sale. Let's swing by and see what they have. Well, I found one thing and it was this little lantern. Isn't it cute? Still had the tag on. The lady said she had not used it. It was originally $16.99 from Home Goods for only $3. So I picked that up and I'm hoping to use it in my fall decorating. That wraps up today's fall haul, y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. Please comment down below and let me know what was your favorite piece of fall decor. I hope to see you back on the next video so we can decorate together. Bye.